Hi guys, this video will introduce you how to manage Hyper-V server remotely. For example, you can create virtual machine, virtual switch, access PowerShell from other computer and so on. Don't take your time. Let's start. On Hyper-V server, open command line by typing 14, then run command to start PowerShell. There are two things we have to do on server. First, enable this Hyper-V server to receive PowerShell remote commands. Second, enable CRED SSP authentication on this server. Okay. Now, we're done on server side. Next step, we will work on window client. This computer will use to connect and manage Hyper-V server. First, go to Windows features and select Hyper-V. Your computer will restart after you enable it. Next, open PowerShell in admin mode. Then check your network profile by using command get net connection profile. If your network category is public, you have to change it to private. Using command set net connection profile. After that, we update Windows hosts file, append IP and computer name of Hyper-V server to hosts file. In order to manage Hyper-V server on this computer, we need to configure the local computer for remote management. We use command set wsman quick config. Type Y to confirm. Next, add server to trusted host. The value parameter is your server name. Type Y to confirm. Then we can use command get item to check the trusted host. Now, let's enable cred SSP authentication on this computer. The delegate computer is your Hyper-V server. Type Y to confirm. Using command get cred SSP to check again. Final, create Hyper-V server credentials and store on this computer. This credentials are passed to a remote computer to be authenticated. All configures are done. Next, I will introduce for you two tools using to manage Hyper-V server are Hyper-V Manager and Window Admin Center. Let's try Hyper-V Manager first. Hyper-V Manager allows you to create, modify, and delete virtual machines, VM checkpoints, virtual switches, and virtual hard disks in addition to letting you manage Hyper-V hosts both locally and remotely. Open Hyper-V Manager. Select Connect to Server then type Server Name to connect. Perfect. Now we can manage Hyper-V server remotely. Another tool I want to show for you is Windows Admin Center. It is a locally deployed, browser-based app for managing Windows servers, clusters, hyper-converged infrastructure, as well as Windows 10 PCs. It is a free product and is ready to use in production. 
First, you have to install it on your computer. You can get it on Windows Evaluation Center. Similar with Hyper-V, you have to fill out a form before download link is available. When downloading is completed, just install it. Select Window Admin Center Client in Certificate Selection pop-up. Click to add server. Input your server name to connect. Now you can manage Hyper-V server on a web-based app. Let's discover yourself about this tool. Okay, that's all. In next video, I will show you how to deploy a Kubernetes cluster on Hyper-V server. Thank for watching. And don't forget to subscribe my channel.